We begin in Burlington at the Royal Botanical Gardens, where some people got an unexpected surprise yesterday while out on their morning walk. They came across a python snake. Sean Cowan is live at Cherry Hill Gate on Plains Road with more on this. Good evening, Sean. Hey, Matt. Uh, well, imagine this, taking a walk right down this path right here to enjoy some nature. Maybe you'll see some birds, some chipmunks, or some squirrels, or even possibly some small snakes. But imagine seeing a python. Well, it happened. Horrified of snakes. Horrified. While Margaret Bennett may be scared of snakes, she says the one she saw yesterday while out on her morning walk wasn't frightening. The snake was scared. So it wasn't moving and I could see that it was still alive. So I wasn't really worried it was going to jump on me. It was a ball python snake, according to Burlington Animal Services, and they were called yesterday to pick up the animal. The python is currently being held by Animal Services, but they did send us this video. The snake is in a 10 day quarantine period while they wait for the owner to possibly come forward. Amanda Steen is the director at Little Ray's Reptile Zoo and Nature Center in Hamilton where they have five ball pythons. While she says the snakes are not native to this area, she's not surprised one was on the loose. Snakes are curious creatures. They will explore their environment. Um, so if there is a weak part in their habitat, they will find it <laughs> and fortunately will get out. According to Little Ray's, ball pythons are a pretty common pet throughout Ontario for a couple of reasons. They're generally pretty friendly. They don't need a lot of attention and their average age is around 30 years old. They are legal. You can find them in pet stores and things like that. Um, usually they range between about three to five feet full grown. Um, definitely not as big as some of their python relatives. Burlington Animal Services suspects the snake was a pet that somehow escaped from their owner. But Margaret says it also could have been placed here. I feel really bad for the snake. Somebody dumped it there and it was looking as if to say, you know what, uh, where'd my owner go, you know? And I just spoke with these people behind me here and they tell me that they are happy the python was picked up yesterday and they didn't discover it while on their walk here this evening. It is legal to have a python in your home in the city of Burlington as long as it's under three meters. If you think this is your pet or you know where it came from, you can call the city of Burlington.